All right, you guys, it is time to check out G Friends Comeback Stage Performances. We're going to get into Labyrinth first, and then we're going to go to Crossroads because it looks like that's the order that they were premiered in. Um, I'm pretty excited to check this out, so let's get into it. We've yet to see them on a comeback stage. I haven't. So this will be interesting to see real performance elements and everything in it and not just the dance practice or a music video. So a little clash of both. My girl. That's an interesting visual. Oh, they got all kinds of backup dancers for this. Such a powerful image. Everyone dancing around them, they're completely still. I like the like EDM of this one. I used to love EDM, I still do. I love her voice, to be honest, as we progress. It's very innocent. <laughs> there she is. <laughs> I can't not see her as tall now. I saw that wink. I saw that wink. I'm just saying. Do you guys see it? Ah! Oh. Get it, girls. It's happening, guys. You are seeing me fall more and more in love with G Friend. I'm a sucker for live performances. What does she have on her hands? She's got like some type of glittery... It's not even like a full glove. That's interesting. Very different than Crossroads when it comes to this, the type of song. Not in a bad way. I love it, I love it, guys. Yes. Not too long. She didn't hold it for too long, which is, it made it nice. Oh, I love the background high notes. It's like a dance break for me. Yes. that look all right well to be honest i might have liked that one a little bit more than crossroads right now we'll see i still listen to crossroads i listened to it a bunch today already uh but i do think i might have liked that one it really hit home with me with the edm style because i love edm i used to listen to it a lot more frequently than i have been um, so I'm not really into that kind of scene anymore, but I really did like the EDM style. I love that they can do so many varieties of genre. Now, is EDM style something new for them? Because you guys said they were a lot of more orchestra. 
orchestral and strings and and all of that previous and we heard that in crossroads as well so you guys have to let me know down in the comments if edm is something they've touched on before or not so we're going to go ahead and get into crossroads and check out that live performance which i'm excited since we've seen the other components of it we've seen the music video and we've seen the dance practice so let's go ahead and get into that Oh, there's the clock. Oh, they look way younger there. I wonder if those are, are those actual younger? Yeah, it looks like it's all older stuff. Okay. Something as well in Western culture and Western music, we don't really do this. And it's so cool and so unique. It makes it such a spectacle when, when musicians or artists release their music that you see it on the stage like this is the first time you're getting to see it on a stage type thing and everyone can consume it at, at once and together it's really unique and i like it a lot it's k-pop industry is so unique and that's i think one of the biggest draws for me as a music lover and their performance style is just outrageous i love it Okay, so they're starting at a different stance than the dance track. No, there it is. Okay. In the middle. They do so many hand gestures and stay synchronized, and it's... You know, you'd think that maybe it wouldn't be as hard, but it's so hard with six people. Love that little slide. <laughs> it's so playful. They do such a good job with uh, hitting all their marks like forcefully so that you really notice it but also remaining very fluid. What? Oh, I guess that's like lights they have on the ceiling following them? Holy that was awesome. Is this that labyrinth part where it looks like they're... Oh my goodness, that's so cool. Oh. Sounds just as amazing live.
seemed like they harmonize a lot more in this song, but with it being more of a like upbeat and not EDM as much, um, it's not more about the soloist parts, you know. I love both performances 100%, but I think I like Labyrinth more. Um, you, maybe more just music wise, and I love the strings and everything. I think it really just feels or it depends on the mood I'm in, really. And the EDM really just like hit me. That was that was a good one. I wasn't expecting it, being that most of you guys said that they're really more orchestral and stuff like that, which obviously every group pr branches out a little bit into different genre types. So that was that was something I wasn't expecting. I'd like that a lot. I will definitely be adding that to my playlist. All right, guys. So that's gonna be it for this reaction. Uh, I really love the comeback stage. I need to watch more comeback stage stuff from G Friend and other artists. It's so cool to see live performances. They really hit hit a different spot for me. You know, you hear artists perform on a recording, and then you see them live, and some of them don't always sound the same. But K-pop as an industry seems to always sound so similar. They always are great. You know, they got the great vocals, the great dancing, and the great visuals, and they bring it all in the performance too. It's not just when they're you know recording things and doing things in the editing phase and all of that you see it up here on the stage and i love that so we're definitely gonna have to check out some more we will be doing sunrise the music video here uh, we'll be doing a reaction for that soon as well so thank you guys so much for stopping by and checking out this reaction as usual like and subscribe if you're interested in seeing more content from me and uh, i'll see you guys down in the comments